And this week, students across our city are out of school for spring break. So if you're still looking for fun and unique activities to do, we've got an idea for you. You got to have to get your hands dirty. We're talking about picking out your own strawberries. And joining me right now to talk about the Strawberry Festival happening is farmer Tyler Froberg at Froberg's Farm. Good morning. Good morning, guys. How are we this morning? Doing great. And it looks like a great day to go out there. Tell us about Froberg's Farm. Absolutely. So here at Froberg's Farm in Alvin, Texas, we are proud to say that it is our 82nd year to invite Houstonians out to our family farm to pick their own strawberries. You heard me right. Since World War II, my great grandfather started allowing uh, Houstonians to come out and pick their own strawberries right here at the farm. That's amazing. So and, and then how long has the strawberry <laughs> festival been going on? Like what have you got going on right now? So the Strawberry Festival this year will go on through March 30th. We're open every day this week, as well as every Saturday and Sunday through March 30th. Now, strawberry picking days do vary based on uh, how much fruit is available. It's a very popular activity this week, but our festival is open every day. You can come out and ride tractor rides. You could shoot apple, apples out of a cannon. We have food trucks set up, delicious food like shaved ice, hot dogs, chicken sandwiches, cotton candy, you name it. We even have live music. Cool. And where's the farm located? I know you said Pasadena, but where exactly and what are the hours that you're open? Oh. We are in Alvin, Texas. Sorry, right Alvin. Off Highway 6. My bad. It's, that's all right. And we are open every day for uh, the festival from 9 till 430. And then how much does it cost to come out if somebody wants to come out and pick strawberries? How much does that cost? So it's five dollars per person. Not bad. Uh, how, what's the turnout been like this week? Have you guys been pretty crowded for spring break? It's been a little crazy around here, <laughs> but in the best way possible. We love getting Houston families up close and personal with their food, especially their strawberries. Well, we're showing pictures on the screen right now. We see kids picking some strawberries that look absolutely delicious. So it definitely looks like a great time. And then you've also got a country store on site. Like what else can people go home with if they come out there? That's right. So like we're a real family farm. So when you walk into the country store, Grandma Froberg is going to be there to greet you. Uncle Alfred's going to be out in the field showing you where the absolute best strawberries to pick are. You can find organic milk, our eggs raised right here at the farm, as well as our produce. And you'll have to stop by our delicious bakery. Nice. So you truly are a generation of farmers. You've got Grandma Froberg still there. You said that you were what, like the third generation to be running the farm? I, I am the fifth generation fifth. right here in Alvin, Texas. Fifth. Wow. That's amazing. And and being of the younger generation of Frobergs to run the farm, uh, you're pretty active on TikTok. So how have you been using like social media <laughs> platforms to help educate people about farming in our area? Well, so we do have a reach here in the Houston area and we love our Houstonians and we love inviting them out to the farm. But what we're really proud of is our worldwide reach. We know that not everybody in the world lives right here in Houston and not everybody can come and visit the farm. So since they can't, we bring the farm to them. We show them everything that we do, how we do it, and then a few tips and tricks about how you can grow your own stuff at home. So I actually am, am not gonna be able to bring my kids out for spring break, but what are your normal hours? Like, are you open year round? Can we come next week? Can we come anytime? Absolutely. So I have a tractor passing by right now because we are a farm. It's live uh, television. Yes, That's fine. Our, country, <laughs> our farm and country store is open seven days a week from eight to six. We for our community, we are like the local grocery store where people can come out and they can get our homegrown eggs. They can get their produce as well as some other grocery items. Tyler Froberg, you are a pleasure to speak with. Are you out there at the farm? Can I can I come meet you? Please do myself, my wife, my kids. Most of my family is out here at the farm. Come out and, and make some memories with us. Yeah, you are a lot of fun and it looks like a lot of fun happening behind you, even though nobody's out there yet. But I can just tell that that's a great place to bring a family. Thank you so much for joining me this morning. Appreciate it. Thank you all so much.